Hi, Andrew here, KNRMWine.com, your favorite place to buy wine and spirits online. Uh, today we're trying Mara Martins Godello 2016 from Monterey in Spain. So the Monterey region is up in the Galathea part of Spain, which is up in that northwestern corner, close to uh, Reyes Baxis, uh, if that's how you pronounce it. And um, So the famous variety up in that part of the world would be Albarino, but the second sort of variety or Lesser well known certainly, and maybe an up and coming variety would be the Godello, um, and produces a different style of wine, I suppose. So uh, the Monterey region uh, is translates roughly as the King's Mountain, and it's, it's basically the the region that it's in. It has those sort of gravelly, silty, sandy soils there. It benefits from that Atlantic climate that uh, Reyes Baxis has as well. So you tend to get quite a Quite a damp climate, but you'll get nice dry summers in it as well. Um, great for white wines, as we know with the Reyes Baxis of uh, Albert of uh, the Reyes Baxis. So this wine here, um, seasonal oak. It's all hand harvested, which is an expensive way of producing any wine because of the labour costs. Obviously, it's um, fermented for maybe. 36 hours I believe and then it spends time in stainless steel it spends about two months or three months on lees uh, I believe uh, before being bottled and that then adds a bit of weight and texture just taking that little bit of um, complexity and flavor from the lees the dead yeasts I suppose uh, dead yeast cells in there so color wise when you pour it out it is quite pale um, Pretty see-through to be fair, there's not much colour to this at all. Immediately in the nose, now with a wine like this here, coming from the type of climate it comes from and the type of wine making it is, it's all very clean, uh, cooler climate I suppose. You'd expect those aromatic styles of wines and that's exactly what you get. You get a nice melon style aromatics you don't get the sort of the pungency you would get from say the albarinos but you do get a nice melon sort of yellow fruit spectrum uh, nose a little touch of sort of fennel in the background of that as well hmm you can see you know just smelling this wine how it would work quite well with fish probably, um, particularly if you think of those fennel flavours, fennel works really well with fish typically, um, but it's neutral, it's not It's not really pungent like a Sauvignon Blanc for example uh, from New Zealand, it would be much more restrained, much more food friendly in this respect, so it will balance probably better with a lot of food. Mm. So the effect of that time on lees, you feel that on the mouth. It has that sort of bit of weight, bit of texture coming through. Really nice, fresh, natural acidities in there as well. Nice crisp or lemony almost finish to it. A nice lingering finish as well. Really nice example of a modern, fresh style of wine. Uh, designed to be early drinking of course you, you're not expected to ease these styles, styles of wines at all but really good with fish dishes um, salad -y dishes to a degree I suppose as well and probably work quite well with spice I would think um, so yeah it's a nice bottle of wine it's definitely interesting if you want to explore those indigenous or unusual grape varieties of Spain particularly or anywhere really if you want to try an unusual grape variety Godeo is a really interesting one you get some really nice examples and it comes from that very localized part of Spain in the northwest in the Galatea so there you go Mara Martin Godeo uh, from 2016 remember kwmwine.com please reduce batters cheers